Hello everyone, it's Lauren and welcome back to my channel. So today I am in Paris, which is so crazy, but today is also my birthday. It is Ooh. March <laughs> It's March 8th and I have wanted a Chanel bag for so long and I'm in Paris on my birthday where the original Chanel store is. Coco Chanel lived in her apartment upstairs and I might be buying a bag today. I'm very nervous about it just because it's a lot of money. Um, so big commitment there. I don't know if you're seeing this video I probably bought it because I wouldn't post this video if I didn't so I might be buying a bag I might not be but regardless I'm gonna take you guys inside the original Chanel store which is very exciting I'll show you guys the bags that I try on hopefully John's checking himself out in the background I'm kind of nervous I heard kind of have to like schmooze up the sales associates because they can choose not to let you buy a bag even if you have the money and you're like I want to buy a bag they can be like no just because they want to be rude I don't know but hopefully we have a good experience today in store I have a feeling I mean I should have made an appointment that's on me but we're just gonna wait outside I guess yeah, hopefully yeah, I'll take the hopefully the line's not gonna be too long so yeah I don't know I might be coming back on here with a Chanel bag. I might be crying in my sorrows. Also, this is the fit for today. Very extra. I have like an oversized black blazer that I'm going to put on with this and some leather gloves that like go up to here. Um, we're going to go to Cafe de Flore. So that should be really fun. It's raining today, so it's a little bit chilly. So we might get some hot chocolate and Get a cute picture. Here is the storefront. And hopefully, it doesn't look like there's a line, so we will see. Okay, so we had to put our name in the queue and we have to wait an hour, so we're just walking around to kill some time before our appointment. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared. So, I wanted a very specific bag. And she had to go downstairs to get it. It doesn't come back in stock until tomorrow, but because I leave tomorrow, she was gonna let me try it. Took me into a separate room, because you can't have it in front of everyone. And I think I'm gonna buy it. You guys. <laughs> okay, so the fact that I'm posting this video means I got a Chanel bag, which is so crazy because I started this video and I didn't think 
I was ever gonna post it because I went the first time, didn't have the best experience. We waited forever and the guy that eventually helped us, he clearly did not want to help me. Um, I don't know if he thought I didn't have money or he was just like, I don't feel like dealing with her even though I'm a very pleasant person to be around. But um, I kept showing him bags I wanted. He's like, no, 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 we don't have that. And he didn't even put in any effort to show me what I want. And so today I'm like, you know what? We were walking around. I'm like, you know what? Let's go in the store again. Why not? We went to the one um, on the corner, a door down. Um, it's still the 31 Rue Cambone or Camp. I don't know how to pronounce it, but it was still the iconic flagship store. So we go inside, we get accepted immediately and we go upstairs and they offer us water, super nice. And the sales associate was so freaking nice. And she made the experience the coolest thing ever. I should probably like make this less like you're laying in bed with me. Like <laughs> I'm just like laying sideways talking to my friends. But she came over and was so nice. And she's like, is this your first Chanel bag? I'm like, yes. And she's like, oh my God, so exciting. Like she made it fun. And so she brought me some bags. I showed her the ones I wanted and she's like, I can bring a bunch of similar options if we don't have it, which great. She put in the effort and the guy literally didn't put in any effort at all. John's sniffing my bag right now. <laughs> she at least tried to like find me something that I would love. So she brings a bunch of bags over and they're cute, but it's not my dream bag. I'm just like, I was trying to make myself fall in love with it. And I just, it wasn't what I wanted. I wanted the two straps where you can like kind of adjust it and have it short or long. Um, and they all were just long straps that you couldn't do anything. It was just a single strap. So John could even tell I was just like trying to convince myself to buy the bag. And then I don't know. I just kept being like, I love the classic. And I originally wanted the mini. And she's like, let me see if we have anything. Everything is sold out everywhere. She's like, let me look at other boutiques and everything. And so she couldn't find anything. She's like, let me go downstairs and just check. You never know. So she comes back up and she has this bag in a, another bag. It's like secret. And she comes up and she's like, we'll move somewhere else. And I was like, oh, like we're going to move. And she was like looking around. She's like, no one can know about this. Like making me feel like so cool. She's like, we have to go to a private room for me to bring this out. Because if anyone sees it, everyone's going to want it. And I'm like, oh my God, this is so fun. So we moved to the back room by ourselves and two ladies walk in and she's like looking at them like, like she can't open it in front of them. I'm like, how exclusive is this? Oh my God. And she's like, the fact that I found this is crazy. It's not even supposed to be in stock in the store until tomorrow, but because you leave on your flight tomorrow, I'm making an exception and she pulls it out and it's literally my dream bag i fall in love with it and it is more expensive than the bags that i was looking at which hence the dream bag hence like the, it's the dream dream bag yes hence the dream Not bag just the dream bag oh i could get <laughs> yes and so i immediately i'm just like oh like i love this bag i'm in love with it but i'm not gonna get it like and john is like well if you really want it get it and i'm like hold up John's now peer pressuring me into getting this bag. And I thought he wouldn't approve. And he's like, no, get it. Like, this is the coolest experience ever. Like, she's made you feel so welcome. She's made you feel like this is such a cool experience. So I'm like looking at it and I'm getting really hot because I'm getting really nervous. And because I know I'm falling in love with it as I'm looking at it. And John just kept being like, if you want it, get it. And I was like, screw it. I'm going to get it. I just said it. I'm like, screw it. I'm going to get it. And yeah. So I, I just got it. And then she's like, do you want me to bring you champagne, some macaroons? So she brings over champagne. They were out of macaroons, which I don't really care about. Um, but she brought us champagne. The experience was just so cool. And then she's like, okay, the next step is we're going to take you to take, or we're going to take you so you can go take a picture on the steps of, I guess, they're just like known as the iconic steps in Chanel. So I took a picture there and then she's like, 
now we're going to spray you with some perfume. And so I got to pick out my favorite Chanel scent and she sprayed it all over me and then she sprayed it all over John. And John ended up buying the scent that she sprayed on him because he really liked it. So yeah, I ended up buying the Chanel. I am absolutely in love with it. I have no buyer's regret or whatever it's called. I typically do when I spend a lot of money, but I like feel very good about this. Like I don't feel sick to my stomach. Like I feel very happy about the experience. I'm in Paris on my birthday and I bought a Chanel bag, like. But she made it great. She made it great. If she wouldn't have been so cool, I don't think I would have bought it. Like I just didn't, I would have been more stressed out and she was making it fun and exclusive. Like, I don't think I would have bought it if she wouldn't have been so cool. Cause it's John okay. also wouldn't have been like, you should get it. I saw how happy it made you. Yeah. Which was the fun part. Did you notice when I was trying it on, everyone around me was staring at it? Yeah. Did you notice that? Yeah. Everyone, because that's the we bag. We went into another room and everyone was like, wait a minute. Yes. Everyone was looking at me because everyone wanted the bag. They're all like, oh my God, like, that bag. And I'm just like, I got it. It's it mine. Because they didn't have that bag on display. She literally went under. And the only reason she did is because you were talking about it in black and gold because yeah. we were only showing like the navy blue yeah she's like this is sold out everywhere the fact that we have this for you right now is fate and i'm like i agree and i guess i should show you guys the bag i don't know how <laughs> i'm gonna edit this here she is in all her glory just like the most beautiful bag i've ever laid my eyes on so soft the quality is just like everything i am so excited whenever i get back to california i'll probably do like a better unboxing for you guys or maybe i'll just do that as a separate video this one will be about my experience buying it and then i'll do a whole unboxing going through the inside and all of that jazz okay you guys that is it for this video my bag and i have made it safely back to los angeles i love her I'm so happy with the whole experience the second time around. And I do plan on doing a full like unboxing, go, going more into depth on like the inside of the bag and all of that jazz. Also, excuse my appearance. I slept in braids last night and my hair is just kind of craziness. Thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. And if you are looking to get a Chanel bag, if the first time doesn't work out, I definitely say try again the second time. Just like don't put pressure on it. Um, and hopefully you find the right sales associate for you. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And if you want to be notified every time that I post a video, you can hit the bell notification that is down below on one of these sides. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. If you liked it, comment down below what your dream Chanel bag is. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.